The Tri-City Outlaws returning to Alumni Stadium for a home game on Saturday night. Tri-City with a 2-1 record as they battled the Sudbury Spartans. Opening quarter, the Outlaws near midfield. Pat Wright is looking long and he hits Arkelius Jack on the far side. A big completion for the Outlaws. They're looking to strike first and a few plays later, it's Pat Wright and a QB keeper. He battles his way in for a touchdown. Nice work there from the Outlaws O-line. Tri-City's up. Seven nothing. That it's a solid play from the Outlaws defense. They bring pressure. Sean Harper and Paul Szymanski both in on the tackle. Still seven nothing. Second quarter now. The Spartans find the end zone on this play. The running back fighting hard. He bounces off the defenders and he's got a touchdown. The extra point is no good. So it's seven six Outlaws. Later in the quarter, how about this play? Pat Wright firing deep. There's our Kelly is Jack and he's got it for a touchdown. That's a thirty two yard passing play. Tri-City is now leading 14-6. Still in the second. Here's the play everyone is buzzing about. Watch the far side. Jake Eagers with an interception. He's heading the other way and welcome back Jake Eagers. You've got a pick six for a touchdown. Excellent from Eagers. He makes it 21-6 for the Outlaws. Back to the defense and watch number one. That's Braden Hill. He's got a pick. The former St. Benedict star with an interception ending the Spartans possession. But a little later, here's a beauty play from Sudbury. The Spartans with some trickery in the final minute of the quarter. They trail 21-14 at the break. Third quarter now. The Spartans looking to tie it up. It's a deep ball. There is Corey Watson, Viola, and he's also got a pick. Big play in the end zone, and it stays 21-14. Later in the third, the Outlaws on the doorstep. The handoff for Roland Tremblay, and he's got a touchdown. Tremblay extends the lead. Tri-City is up 28-14. Then we've got some dance moves from Paul Szymanski. He breaks through for a sack. A little shimmy and a little shake from Szymanski. Fourth quarter now. How nice is this catch from Arkelius Jack? He's got it inside the five-yard line. The Outlaws on the move, and a few plays later, there's no stopping Pat Wright. He barrels his way into the end zone for an Outlaws touchdown. Wright makes it 34-20. Later in the quarter, watch the near side. It's Tyson Green with a pick, and the Outlaws pick up the victory. They take it by a final score of 34-26 in Power 5 football on Saturday night.